In today's video, we are diving into something a bit different. I'm breaking down the first five steps you should take after creating your HoneyBook account. Whether you're setting it up for the first time or just looking for some guidance, I've got you covered. Keep watching if you're ready to take your HoneyBook setup to the next level. So if you're someone who's new to HoneyBook, welcome. This video is essentially a beginner's tutorial. I want to guide you through the first steps so you can get your HoneyBook account running smoothly from the start. For those of you who are new to it, HoneyBook is a client relationship management CRM system. It's a platform designed to help you run your business more efficiently, from managing client bookings to payments, contracts, and beyond. So let's get started with the first five steps for setting up your HoneyBook account. These steps will help you set up your account, make sure everything is customized to fit your business, and ensure that you can hit the ground running. The very first thing you'll want to do is determine the best method for onboarding your clients into HoneyBook. There are a few different workflows to choose from. One popular option is using a contact form on your website to capture leads. For instance, wedding planners, event coordinators often set up these forms, so when a potential client submits an inquiry, their information is automatically added into HoneyBook. This is a great option for those who prefer an automated process, ensuring that every single client inquiry is immediately organized and stored in the system whether or not they end up booking. If I were to input every single person into HoneyBook, it would quickly become cluttered and hard to manage. Instead, I prefer to vet inquiries via email first and only add those who are ready to move forward with booking into the system. This helps me maintain a cleaner workflow and ensures that HoneyBook only holds relevant, actionable client information. So, as you start setting up your HoneyBook account, consider which workflow makes the most sense for you. If you want to fully automate the process, the contact form setup will be your starting point. If you prefer a more manual approach, you can skip that step and move on to the next part of the setup. Next up, you'll want to go to your company settings and personalize everything about your business. HoneyBook gives you so many opportunities to customize the way you present yourself to your clients. In the company settings, you'll want to enter your basic information, your contact details, your website, and so on. But the real magic happens when you move into the brand elements section. This is where you can upload your logo, adjust the colors of buttons, and set images that will appear on your files. This gives you a polished, cohesive look that represents your brand well. You can also choose a default image that will appear on the top of your files. These customizations might seem small, but they're crucial for presenting a consistent and professional experience to your clients. Also, make sure to customize your email signature here. You can tailor your signature to suit your communication style. Finally, don't forget to set your notification preferences. I like to be kept in the loop about everything happening with my clients, whether they've opened a file, made a payment, or signed a contract. So, I've got all of my notifications turned on. You can also set up reminders for payment due dates and other important tasks. Now, we're getting to one of the most crucial steps in setting up your HoneyBook account creating templates. This part can be a little time consuming, but trust me, it will save you hours in the future. Templates are the backbone of your workflow. They let you skip the repetitive task of creating contracts, emails, invoices, and proposals from scratch every time a new client comes along. With templates, all you need to do is input specific details, and the system will autofill the rest so you're ready to send with just a click. Here, you'll see a list of all the types of templates you can create, contracts, invoices, emails, and proposals. The more thorough you are with this, 
the smoother things will go. I highly suggest setting up templates for everything you send on a regular basis. For instance, have a contract template ready to go for new clients, an invoice template for billing, and email templates for common communication, such as follow-ups, proposal submissions, or appointment reminders. When it comes to contracts, HoneyBook allows you to customize each section with smart fields. These smart fields automatically pull in client-specific data, such as their name, event date, or location. This ensures that every document you send is personalized without any extra effort on your part. All you need to do is set up the smart fields correctly, and HoneyBook will automatically fill in the necessary details each time you use the template, saving you even more time. When it comes to invoices, HoneyBook makes things incredibly easy by allowing you to set up predefined packages. These packages contain all the details and pricing for your services. That way, when it's time to send an invoice, you simply click on the appropriate package and all the relevant information will be populated automatically. This is an absolute game changer, especially when you're juggling multiple clients or projects. Instead of manually typing out each service and cost, HoneyBook does all the heavy lifting for you ensuring accuracy and efficiency every time. The next step in optimizing your workflow with HoneyBook is syncing your calendar. HoneyBook allows seamless integration with popular calendar platforms like Google Calendar, Apple Calendar, and Outlook, making it super easy to manage all your events in one place. After syncing your calendar, every meeting, client appointment, project deadline, and shoot will be visible right on your HoneyBook dashboard. Plus, the system color codes events for easy identification. Red might represent upcoming deadlines, and green for payments due. This color coding ensures you can instantly prioritize your day at a glance. The best part is that syncing your calendar with HoneyBook consolidates all your events in one spot eliminating the need to jump between different apps or platforms. For example, let's say you've got a meeting with a client scheduled in Google Calendar and a deadline in Apple Calendar. Once integrated, both will show up together in HoneyBook, creating a single, unified schedule. You won't need to worry about missing critical tasks or double booking yourself, because everything is updated in real time. For anyone who's used to managing their schedule digitally, this syncing feature will feel like a major upgrade. It gives you more control over your day and ensures that you're always aware of what's coming up, without the hassle of managing multiple tools. Before you send out your first proposal on HoneyBook is setting up your payment details. This step is crucial, as it ensures that payments are processed seamlessly and efficiently. In this section, you'll connect HoneyBook to your preferred payment method, whether that's a bank account, PayPal, or another payment processor. If you're using a bank account, you'll link it directly for direct deposits, so you can receive payments straight into your account. Setting up your payment details also allows you to customize your payment plans. For example, if you prefer to offer clients the option to pay in installments, you can configure a payment plan with automatic reminders. HoneyBook lets you decide whether you want clients to pay in full upfront or in portions. You can set the payment schedule, due dates, and amounts, and HoneyBook will take care of sending them reminders as those dates approach. Additionally, you can set up late payment fees if necessary to help ensure timely payments from your clients. Once everything is set up, you're ready to start sending proposals with secure and reliable payment options built right in. This integration means that you won't have to worry about chasing payments or handling complicated invoicing manually. Everything is automated, saving you both time and effort. So to better understand whole process of using HoneyBook, first decide how you want to use HoneyBook, whether through a contact form or a manual process.
Once you've chosen your method of intake, it's time to personalize your HoneyBook account. Update your business details, add a logo, and choose colors that align with your brand identity. Whether you're running a creative studio, consulting service, or coaching business, customizing your account ensures all your communication with clients is on brand, making you look more professional and organized. Next, you'll want to set up templates for documents you send regularly, like contracts, invoices, proposals, and follow-up emails. These templates save you tons of time by automatically filling in client details such as names and dates, so you don't have to manually update every document. Once your templates are ready, sync your calendar with services like Google Calendar or iCloud so that you can keep all your appointments, meetings, and events in one place. This ensures that you never double book yourself and that you always have a clear view of your schedule. Finally, make sure you link your bank account so payments are processed smoothly. With HoneyBook, clients can pay directly through the platform, and your payments will automatically be deposited into your bank account, eliminating the need for manual invoicing. By completing these five steps, setting up your onboarding method, customizing your branding, creating templates, syncing your calendar, and linking your bank account, you'll have a smooth, organized system in place that makes it easier to manage clients, streamline your processes, and ultimately provide a professional experience that keeps your business running smoothly.